What is going on guys and we are coming back with some more foam stars. I've been enjoying it so far I don't know about you. Let me in the comment section down below uh, if you are enjoying foam stars or have you even tried it out uh, If you have if, if you're unsure about this game or how you feel about it uh, You do in your on PlayStation you do have a PS Plus it is it completely free So put it in your library download it try it out uh, If you don't like it well you lost yourself five minutes if you do like it well then you guys have a new game you can go to every single day but yeah we're, we're gonna possibly check out this new mode extreme party uh it can be good or it can be complete chaos um but also before we actually go into that i want to bring into uh the item shop let's see what's going on today i think it's the same thing because it says three days uh left but this this game i think absolutely has potential in my personal in. opinion um i'm not sponsored paid in any way to say this i'm giving you my shit of honesty Events, all elite. Let's Very see what's going on good. here. Blue Paisley, eleven dollars. Red Ship, three fifty. This is something I believe even Fortnite could pick up. In my personal opinion, I kind of hate how um it's like V box and it's like almost like point based. Kind of reminds you of like the Minecraft, the, the, the Minecraft, the Microsoft Store, how that used to be. Um, those of you OGs know, then I guess you know. But that's kind of a trip to even think about. We don't even have Microsoft points anymore. It's all currency so it's kind of crazy <clears throat> do not to go off topic i do think fortnite could have. pick up this eleven dollar two dollar three dollar four dollar because some of the skins when you buy it in fortnite if you really add it up can be only like ten eleven dollars but just to get to that freaking skin you got to spend 15 to 25 or 20 it's some odd amount that you really don't actually need so if you feel like you're spending more than you actually are really you're not by technicality so if fortnite would adapt to a system like this then realistically, you're not spending all that much money. Like, what, five forty nine for a dance? I mean, yeah, somewhat expensive, but it's acceptable. Cream soda board. I've been thinking about buying that for like ages now. Uh, let me in the comment section. Should I grab it before it leaves the item shop for four dollars? Um, if you want me to, then I'll do it and just we ball. Do consider all. Oh, let's see what's going on with standards. On. So like a lot of these new character skins that you can actually grab. This kind of makes me think of, can we actually, no, we probably can't bring it up, can we? It's 44 something for these bundles, okay. I think it's more to it than just the skins, I think that's why. But yeah, this kind of reminds me of the Drift skin, I don't know why, but it kind of does. Yeah, there's just so much stuff that this game, I think, kind of offers. <clears throat> Speaking of offerings, um, slide boards. I may have to get the main. Mr. Agita, <clears throat> do let me know. Oh, this will kind of lit. The fish one over have. here? These boards are actually are kind of sick. Okay, the duck, the duck, the duck, the duck. Jesus Christ. But yeah, be sure to try this game yourself. And uh, I'm hoping you like it. If not, it's not for you. It's fine. Do you consider I mean, some can say save travel, it basically is um, Splatoon. I don't have too much experience with Splatoon. I think I've only played like a game or two back when I got the Wii U. Like some, I don't know, like five, six years ago. Give or take, something like that. <clears throat> So I'm not too familiar with that game, but I can tell you from what I've seen with Splatoon, this is nothing like it. This is more like a Overwatch um, kind of take on Splatoon. But we're gonna go into a game, and we're gonna try out this oh, new yeah, Extreme Party and see what's up, Rubber Duck. Where's the Extreme Party, homie? Homie, where's the Extreme Party? Homie, homie, Rubber Duck Party. That rule. Well, you know what? We ball. Let's go rubber duck. Let's go rubber duck. I don't know why the extreme party wasn't there. It was there like yesterday. Uh, I think, or the day before. So I don't know where it is now, but we're going to try this out. See what this is about. Rubber duck party is a mode where your goal is to take the, number, the rubber duck from center of the stage and put it in the opponent's goal. Okay. <clears throat> okay. For a short time, we'll appear. So kind of capture the flag, but capture the duck. Is that what we're gonna call us? Capture the Duck. Okay. So here we are with Rubber Duck Party, or I guess Capture the Flag, as I had just said. I bet this is gonna get pretty wild. But we went with kind of one of the mains. I mean, I know it's Gito or Gaido or Agaido. I think is his name. However you say that. But I've been calling him Shark Boy for a while now because his abilities basically are like Sharky with a shotgun. So we call him Shark Boy. <laughs> Yeah, I've been using him, and I've also been using uh, so, uh, uh, the Diva kind of boot kind of, which I've also reinstalled Overwatch, 
Maybe I'll toss up and something we'll watch clip. Or maybe a stream or something like that. How does this work? Okay. So do we hit this dude? How does this work? Oh, look at that. So if you don't know a pro tip. Good god. Hold on. Oh, we do things! No! God. Number one. So yeah, pro tip, uh, if the portion of the map is your team's color, you're naturally going to move faster, and you're not going to get slowed down like I'm slowed down here. I don't think you take damage. So you can't however do this, which will slow down when it gets to the pink stuff. So the more area you have in your color, <clears throat> it's kind of give you, kind of give you the better advantage that some people don't realize. So do we hit this to stop? What do we? How does it work? I didn't play this guys, so we're learning together. We're learning together. I'm assuming like, oh okay, hold on. Okay, so you on the flow. Hold the Oh, is that how you? Hold on. No! Help me! 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 Help you! Help me! Oh, don't help me! Awesome! Help me! Help me! Help me! Help you! It's all right. It's all right. We do pretty good. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this game, like, I'm being honest with you, like, when I first seen this as a game and announced, I'm like, okay, this is interesting, but, like, being I wasn't a go out of my way platoon fan, but this has never really got my hands on it, I would have liked to, but maybe, uh, I do plan on getting a Switch, so maybe I will actually grab, was like, Splatoon 3 already out, I believe, somebody help me out here, maybe I will try it out, and maybe now that I've played this, I might change my feelings on Splatoon or just give my general impression. Uh, if I do want to get Switch at some point, uh, maybe not by the end of the year, but at some point. Oh, did we lose? You suck. So I felt like one game wasn't enough for you guys, so we're going to toss in another game. It's going to be Smash the Star, which is basically kind of like a... Almost kind of TDM, but you hunt out for the star player of that team and you eliminate them to win the game, I think, X amount of times. And uh, yeah, as simple as that, not too complex. Um, and also, yeah, I am drinking a Chifo today to power me through editing videos, creating them, playing games, getting me through my day, which I'm drinking me a Chifo today. It's a party punch, so if you like Fruity Pebbles, uh, Party Punch is the way to go, which you might be most lucky to find it on Amazon and not the G Fuel app, as I've not been in stock in a while. But if you are in the G Fuel, let me in the comment section down below, and I'll be sure to help you out the best way I possibly can. And I completely forgot Ooh, that I had to change my, uh... We got saved, though. Oh. Okay, I completely forgot I had to change my, uh... Um, Bumstar, because... Both of my mains got chosen. But well, that's okay because I kind of like this person. Uh, I've only used her at least once or twice. She does have an AR, so she is more effective at just being aggressive. So if you're an aggressive style player, this is probably the way to go. So like her kind of style. Ooh. Jesus. Okay. I don't know where they're coming. Oh no! What happened? A lot of you left. Well, that's no fun. Let's try that again. So yeah, we're taking this back um, for round two and, and a half, three, is I don't know. But yeah, we have another new foam star we're using because all three of our normal use, use um, foam stars have been taken. And so, uh, yeah, somebody knew that I want to use, I think maybe even once. So bear with me on this one here but uh, if you do play foam stars let me know if you have a main oh do you kind of like play with, with, with what's there and just see what you like but you kind of like uncertain yeah she kind of has that you can hold it or you can burst it i kind of like it uh, i'm not too familiar with her abilities okay that's a turn basically okay so she has that 
rules. Here we go already. Oh, what? 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 No, we're getting pushed back. We're getting pushed back. Oh god, let's get up here. We about to get foamy. Let's do it. So I guess that kind of makes it like a grenade launcher, kind of like when you hold it, almost kind of. I take it. I take it. I'm still learning some people. Oh, I did use the big dude, the um, Jet something, I forget his name, but he's like supposed to be like a tank, kind of, like a supportive tank character. This guy is, I just eliminated. Like, I learned a bit more. I think he just got, uh, blocked too. Like, his reload was, uh, really, really unfairly slow. So it got blocked for the short reload time for his weapon. But you know, if you're gonna have tanks, they have to have their, their balancing because if you have like tanks that just like do everything, you're not going to be well, you're gonna be overpowered. So, like I said, make sure you got a lot of foam in your color. Someone's gonna flip that and probably take it out of context or something. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna like. Rambling and talking. That's kind of how I do it. Like, I feel like a douche now. I feel like a douche. We have this in the bag. We have this in the bag. I don't think I had two eliminations, but we had it. Oh god. See, now we're douches. Now we're douches. Buddy, you up here the same Todd, but you know what? I understand you. I understand you, buddy, completely. You know what? I'm a little bit smarter than you, I think. So what does this actually do? Oh, okay. A big oh! Let's go. Oh. How do we actually get up there? We got it, we got it, we got it! No! Help me, somebody! That's not what I meant, homie! So yeah, when somebody is phoned up on your team, use your surfboard and hit them with oh, well. it. It does, um, freedom. Oh, pardon, oh, did we win? Victory. Yeah, we did! But anyways, guys, that's gonna be Foam Stars, uh, today. Uh, kind of want to post a lot more Foam Stars content and maybe even a stream Thank over on Twitch. If you're not following like me on exactly Twitch, there is a channel link in the, the uh, channel description. Um, so yeah, be sure to go check it out and follow me on everything to stay up to date with what is going on. And uh, yeah, like I said before, if you want to try out G Fuel, Thanks, let me know the everyone. comment section down below. Or if you are drinking something today for this video, also let me know what you are drinking today. And as always, guys, keep it energized. Make sure you like it. Make sure you subscribe and follow and join the Strikers family. And I will see you all in the next one.